Spring Celebration in my town. The best opportunity to shoot some videos and to compare different shutter speeds in video mode. In movies, usually a shutter speed that is double of the frame rate is used. I am recording with 25 frames per second, so it would be 1 50th of a second shutter speed. In order to be able to use such a long shutter speed, I attached a variable and D filter, which blocks light from entering the lens. And I also shot without ND filter using a shutter speed between 1 330s and 1 520s of a second. So let's have some fun at the amusement park and see how the shutter speed affects the image. Did you see a difference? Maybe you did, maybe you did not. But there is a difference, which we can see best by stopping the video and analyzing the single frames. The movement of the picture with a long shutter speed like 150s are blurry, while the movement of fast shutter speeds are sharp. But because they are blurry, the movement looks smoother, while the movement of a very short shutter speed can look a bit jerky. When there is only very little movement, the shutter speed doesn't really make any difference. In the end, it really is up to you what you personally prefer, but in my opinion, the differences aren't that big. However, you might want to avoid mixing video files with very different shutter speeds. But please let no one tell you your shutter speed would have to be the double of your frame rate. And I would like to know what shutter speed you usually use when taking videos. Now thanks for watching and if you have any questions then feel free to write in the comments.